New this morning, we are excited as the team from Velisano is here. And we have a big announcement, but we're gonna get to that in a second. Joining me now is Michelle Amato, Senior Vice Chair of Philanthropy. And it seems like just yesterday, Austin and I were out on our tandem bike, riding to Bike to Cure, but we are here now not to talk about just about the race, but we are gonna talk about all of the money raised. The final numbers are in. We're about to learn the final fundraising total for this year's Velisano Bike for the Cure. Uh, the group to help us reveal, we have some special guests who will be unveiling in just a minute. Don't hold it up yet, guys, because this is incredible. I wanna keep the suspense going. First, I wanna to talk to Michelle though, because this is always, you, so many people are involved. So many of you watching right now involved. I wanna to talk to you about just where the money goes. As a reminder, in case anybody tuning in is, is a little unsure or if, if it's going to a new uh, effort, Yep. Where does the money go? Well, thank you for asking. 100% uh, of the dollars that the riders raise and that people give um, go directly to research at Cleveland Clinic. Mm -hmm. And so it is cancer research, new ideas that are not yet ready to be funded by government. Um, some of those crazy out of the box um, thoughts about treatments and diagnosis and early screening. And it's really important to be able to push the envelope and be able to come up with new options for, um, for our patients and for future patients. Yeah, and we've talked in the past about what type of programs and research it's funding anything exciting that that now is going to be funded and we are now going to see advancements. There, there have been uh, numerous projects that have been rewarded by the government and mm -hmm. immunotherapies and different ways to treat. Um, and when you talk about our lung cancers, brain cancer, we have examples of almost of projects in almost every single type of cancer that have earned more federal funding because they've proved that these are great ideas. Mm -hmm. And so this is exactly what we need for our patients because they need more options. Yeah, and I'm sure it's very competitive to get mm -hmm. federal funding. So the money that we raise here, homegrown yep. money, really goes to help. We wanna get to the total, the big announcement. Michelle, here we go. Guys, hold up the signs to show exactly how much money was raised with Velisano. Take it away. Go ahead. Woo! Incredible. $14 million yep. wow. for this year's yeah. Velisano. Wow. $14 million. Michelle, just quickly, like, what does that... That, it, that total's mind-blowing. It, it is mind-blowing. And, you know, so many of us have been a part of Velisano from day one. And to see this number and behind that number are just so many people yes. and that have come together and created this community. I mean, with us today, we've got our partners. We have a 10-year volunteer. Yeah. We have our staff. And our and it's just to, to pull all these people yeah. together. Our clinician researcher who came up, got up early yeah. to put up a one. Yes. Um, and so um, it's just oh my that gosh. number just represents it, the work of so many people. It's incredible guys thank you so much for being here with us this morning and unveiling that total so exciting and we will be right back after this